YouTube. Welcome back to Arabin Outdoors. I'm Arabin and hey, I'm glad you're here. Well, today I had all intentions of doing a video about my timepieces. There seem to be a lot of people who are doing videos where they feature their watches and their pocket watches and so forth and so on. I was going to do the same thing. But then the mail came and uh, I'm excited about this package so I figured I would share it with you and uh, it is from Mr. Brog now those of you who don't know Mr. Brog Mr. Brog is from Poland and um, actually Mr. Brog is a company it is a company from Poland and they make pipes and pipe accessories. And I have never owned a Mr. Brog pipe. And I thought that I would give it a try. The price point on these things, let me look on my phone so I can remember exactly. I got it on Amazon. And uh, yeah, $24.99 for a pipe. You can't beat that. I mean, that's cheaper than what you will pay for a basket pipe in a brick and mortar shop. But anyway, I was perusing through Amazon. I was perusing through Amazon. I was perusing through Amazon. Trying to fill up my cart with my monthly allowance that I'm given. <laughs> Those of you who are married know what I mean. And I came across this uh, Mr. Brog full bent pipe model number 27 and it's called the big horn mahogany and it's made from pear wood roots so from what I understand it's not briar it's made from the roots of pear tree so anyway here we have the box nothing fancy but for $24.99 it says here uh, that you can also buy other accessories they sell lighters tools stands and pouches if I'm pleased with this pipe I might investigate some of their other pouches this is not a review this is a box opening all right, so let's open up the box, and uh, we are coated here in just some plastic or paper, and inside of that we have a clear plastic, and here comes the pipe. Wow, nothing really fancy but I think it's pretty attractive it is a full bent now the one thing it's a good size bowl I don't know what size bowl it is but you can see um, one thing I will do is remove this and take out this diamond filter that comes with the pipe because I just don't like filters nothing against those of you who do but I just don't like the way it inhibits the draw I like to have a good strong full draw so easy modification there nice little stubby stem good looking feels good in the hand looks dashing I may say so what we're going to do is I'm going to, the tobacco that I have here on my back porch, I'm just going to use the last little bit of it, and it is Nutty Java. This is a blend, I think I've mentioned it before in a video or two, it's a very aromatic blend, it's got a really, it's called Nutty Java for a reason. 
it really does have a nice nutty taste to it and uh, it's got a great aroma my wife likes it uh, still won't let me smoke in the house that's okay I've got my back porch here on a beautiful day like this and then I have my fox den if the weather's not that great or if I just want to hang out and listen to some music I was anyway I understand oh that's pretty cool on the bottom of the pipe here you probably won't be able to pick this up it says Mr. Brog Bighorn number 27 which is the model number that's pretty cool I understand it's been a long time since I've had a new pipe but you're not supposed to fill it completely up and you don't want to smoke it too hot the first couple of times but uh, let's give her a light and see what we what we think Now, the nutty java tastes the same. I'm not getting any. Got a great draw without that filter. I love it. How does it look, guys? I think it's a pretty distinguishing looking pipe. Yeah, it's been a long, long time since I've owned a new pipe, and I couldn't go wrong for $24.99. But anyway, do you guys have any experience with Mr. Brog pipes? If so, what are your comments? The reviews were all good of it. But yeah, check it out. Let you take a closer look at it. Mr. Brog, Model 27, full bent. You know what I'm also out of are the little rubber tips. And I have some of those on Amazon. They should be arriving tomorrow. I order them at the same time as this. But Mr. Brog was a little bit quicker at getting his uh, pipe to me. But anyway, that's all I wanted to share with you guys. Maybe later on today, I'll do that timepiece video. I'm not sure. I'll have to dig them up. I don't own many watches. I think I have four pocket watches and four wrist watches. And uh, anyway, till next time, keep calm, carry on, keep puffing, keep it outdoors.